demonstration of uh, some am something amazing you can do in Microsoft Teams that makes it much more than just a video conferencing tool or a chat or discussion tool. Um, that's deep linking. So pretty much any specific place in Teams, any item, you can create a link to it very easily and then give that link to somebody in an email or embed it in a web page or a document, they click on it and if they've got permissions to access that item, they go straight to it. So the first thing you can do here is create a link to a team. Now, that could be a public team, in which case they will join the team straight away if they follow the link. Or if it's one of those teams where they need to be added as a member, you can also give them a join code. So they follow the link, go into the team, use the join code. Um, now, when I do that, I often send the people straight to a specific channel. So you can uh, get a link to the channel. Um, within channels, you can link directly to specific posts. So for example, you could have a post that says, hello, welcome to this team. Please just respond by telling us who you are. And you can copy a link directly to that post and they respond to it, which is brilliant. Um, other things within channels that um, you can link to, files. Um, okay, so let's uh, find a channel that's actually got a file in it. There we go. So um, copy a link specifically to a file or a folder within the files section as well. Um, let's go back to this one. Tabs, so many types of tab, uh, especially embedded tabs like this, you can go over to the dots there and copy a link to the tab, which is brilliant. So um, I can, for example, send a message to the student saying, please have a look today at IDOU podcast because there's something new in there. Um, okay, and ask them, for example, also to use this chat thing here and to give their response to the podcast. Uh, really good. Okay, so outside of um, Teams and channels, uh, you can easily link to a calendar. Let's get a link there to the uh, calendar event to a meeting, a uh, video conference and meeting then, send that to people. Um, and also, when if you've recorded your video conference in meeting, you can do a similar thing to get a link to the recording of the meeting and send that to people, which works very effectively. So there's probably a lot more um, places where you can generate links. I've not yet discovered uh, everything. Oh, look, we've got a whiteboard in this one. And I'm sure you can create a link to the whiteboard as well. Okay, so yeah, that's, uh, as I say, an amazing um, feature to start using. Uh, really effective. Okay, thank you.